title, isn't it? Yes. <laughs> but guess what? It's not going to take very long to make at all. Wow. Only like 15 minutes or less. That's a quick weeknight meal, isn't it? Yeah. And it's going to be delicious. That's even shorter than the name. It is practically <laughs> shorter than the name. <laughs> well, you know, Halloween is right around the corner, so we're starting to see all those pumpkins in the stores, and you like to carve pumpkins, don't you? I love it. Yes, I know you do. <laughs> And a lot of times when you think of pumpkin, you think of something sweet like pumpkin pie or pumpkin cheesecake, which we have a delicious pumpkin cheesecake, don't we? Yes. You gotta be sure to try that one. It's so delish. Anyways, this time we're gonna make it a little bit more savory with the pumpkin alfredo sauce over the noodles, the tortellini with the cheese stuffed tortellini. Okay, can we just get to it? My stomach is starting to like growl for it. <laughs> That's exactly what I want to hear. All right, Maria, let's go ahead and get started on making this. Tortellini with pumpkin alfredo sauce. Here we go. Italian restaurants serve a pumpkin or squash ravioli and it's the only time that I can get it so I take full advantage of it. Now I'm going to add in some heavy cream and then turn your temperature to medium low. And we're going to simmer this for about five minutes or until the heavy cream kind of becomes a little bit thicker. While the pumpkin and alfredo sauce is thickening up, go ahead and add in your cheese tortellini into a pot of boiling water with some salt. We took some help from the store and bought store-bought pre-made stuff, so this really only takes about seven minutes. But if you make your own tortellini, go ahead and use that as well. That's perfectly fine. So Maria's adding two types of cheeses. One is a Gruyere cheese, which is a really nice melting cheese. It's a lot of times what you see in French onion soup. And she's also adding some Parmesan cheese, which is a great Italian cheese. It's going to add just a little bit of nuttiness to this sauce. Looks delish. It does. The last ingredient to our sauce is some freshly ground pepper. Now it's time to add the tortellini into the cream sauce, the pumpkin cream sauce that is. And be sure to reserve a little bit of pasta water because if your sauce gets a little too thick, you can um, loosen it with some of that old that pasta water. And then go ahead and just stir it all together. I know Halloween's all about trick or treat, and this is definitely a treat. To finish off this dish, we're just going to add in some parsley for color. Yes, and you can go ahead and just sprinkle it all around. Yeah. It was fast, wasn't it? Very fast. Yeah, looks good. Yeah, it does. Now, Mom, all we have to do is try it. That's right. Oh, I'm excited to see what Maria thinks of this. Mm-mm-mm. Mm. So good. What do you think? You like it? Love it. It's a little bit of the pumpkin flavor. You probably can't even taste much of it, can you? <laughs> It's just a mild pumpkin flavor. It's so delicious. And the cheeses, you can taste the Gruyere and the Parmesan cheese. And the tortellini that you find just right in the stores is so simple. Right? Right. Do you like this? I love it. Awesome. Oh. Perfect, Maria. I'm glad that you like it. We hope you like it too. It's just another way to do a take on pumpkin and 
something fun just for the kids and whatnot. So, all right, before we finish this bowl, you think we're gonna finish the bowl? Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty good. But it's amazing. It's amazing, right? <laughs> <laughs> but before we do, we want to send you, all of our friends, to our website, AmateurKitchen.tv, to find all of our recipes and videos, including this one. We also want you to head to our Facebook page, Twitter page, Pinterest, YouTube, Instagram, and all those other social medias out there because we're on there. And what do we want everyone to do, Maria? Click that all like button or follow button. <laughs> so you can see what we're up to every single day. All right, I'm gonna keep mowing down on this, are you too? Yeah. All right, mm -hmm. have a great and safe Halloween as well. Try this out, especially if you're having a party for Halloween. This is a great entree to try this one out. So, all right, we wanna see you guys all right back here again next time on Amateur Kitchen. See you later. Bye.